Good afternoon everyone. Welcome to another discussion. Still on unit 1 but now we are in the muscular system. So, atong balikan atong learning objectives last time. Um, if you remember, we have three objectives and uh, for our last discussion, uh, objectives number one and two have already been accomplished. So, we are now at uh, achieving uh, learning objective number three, which is to determine the different muscles involved in the various exercise movements as we are in the muscular system already. Okay, so since we are in the muscular system, we will be discussing, we will be mentioning the major muscles of the body as we progress with the discussion. So before we proceed, um, here's something you need to know about uh, the characteristics of the muscle tissues. No? So there are four, excitability, excitability, contractility, extensibility, and elasticity. No? So excitability, the ability to respond to a stimulus. So ang stimulus, whether it is delivered from a motor neuron, or a hormone. Diba? So, uh, motor neuron, um, muna siya ang mo-emit mo og signal para na, para nga makuman sa imo, ang kuman, gikan sa imo ang brain, ma, mapaabot niya dito sa part sa imong body nga gusto niya ipaliho. No, so, nagita yung command center, then channel siya through the motor neuron. Or it could be the hormone that will let you uh, respond to the stimulus. So that is excitability. Number two, contractility is the ability of the muscle cells to forcefully shorten. Na? So, dili, um, ang muscle ngayon pwede siya mo, mo inat o pwede po siya mo mo shorten mo mo pamubo siya so it kai ko an man siya kana inana ang iya characteristic pud siya mo pat mo mainat og mo shorten na mura lang og mura sa murag sa rubber ba nga pud siya mainat and then so is the ability of the muscle cells to forcefully shorten for okay number 3 is extensibility is the ability of a muscle to be stretched so mainat siya and then elasticity, they return to normal length after stretching. So, ilibot pa sabot nga kaya na stretch na siya. No, mo, dito na siya, di na siya mo balik, mo balik siya. No, they return to normal length after stretching. Okay, now, uh, an example of muscles in action, no, na sa inyo ang handout is, um, Ang example dito kay kanang action in attempting to shoot a ball. So I have prepared here, you know, I think for especially for the basketball players, this guy is quite famous. No? So uh, uh, look at his action. He's actually um, trying to shoot the ball. And with that action, so Nadia akong gilibelan, you have the biceps brachii and the triceps brachii. So, kung mag-contract mag na siya si biceps, ang um, ang um, uh, iyahang kaatbang niya, no, nga, nga result sa sa pag-contract, anak nga muscle, kay mag-relax ang iyahang pair nga muscle, which is the triceps. So, sige. Um, you can try it now. Na? I-try ni mo. Sige, nag-attempt ka o Imagine lang, nag-shoot ka of ball. O, diba? If you touch your, if you touch this portion, na, so, medyo contracted siya, kaya siya, siyempre, mangusog mang ka, kaya gahawid ka sa bola, and, you compare, na, you compare the, the feel of the muscle here, compared to your back. Diba, diri, kung contracted siya, gahit siya diri, sa likod kay, Murag luyat tra siya kay, wala mo siya gikontract. So, relax sa siya. So, muna na, muna yung nangitabo sa muscle ni Stephen Curry, no? Okay. So, uh, on the opposite side of the picture, you can also clearly see the muscles, na The muscles. Kung sa itsura niya, beneath the skin. Muna yung itsura, no? So, at the front, anterior part is the biceps brachii and at the back of that is the triceps. Triceps, brachii. Okay, 
Now, there are other examples of uh, muscle pairs in action. And they they are happening all over our body. Like say, for example, uh, si biceps, always gina siya mag-pair with the triceps. And then for the back, back na to nga muscles, they always pair up with the chest muscles, ang abs muscles na to pairs with the lower back muscles, shoulder muscles pairs with chest and back, quadriceps muscles pairs with hamstring, and tibialis anterior muscles pairs with the calf muscle. No? So, walay walay mag ija ija sa ilaha no da naagid sila uh, partnership always that's how the muscle pairs work in action sa ato ang lawas now there are uh, there are two types of muscle contraction no so number one is the isotonic and the uh, isomeric contraction now, so let's discuss first about the uh, isotonic. So we have two uh, subtypes under isotonic. We have the concentric contraction and the eccentric, eccentric contraction. So di na nato siya, i, um, di na nato siya ipataas, no? Uh, by, by, the, this, by how it is presented on the picture, no? sa concentric contraction, the muscles, muscle uh, fibers are shortened na shorten so with that movement di ba pa upward siya kaniyang example dary pa upward ang imuhang weight so the effect to that on your muscle kay mo shorten ang imuhang length while on the eccentric eccentric contraction is the opposite of that because if you lower down your 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 hand carrying the weight it will cause the the muscles on that area to lengthen so mo mo stretch ang imuhang muscle okay so mo lang na siya uh, sa concentric kay mo shorten kung sa eccentric kay mo lengthen and then the number the second type of uh, contraction is the isomeric wherein dili siya pareha sa concentric o sa eccentric no kay steady lang siya wala siya ibuhaton nga pataas o pa paubos nga movement steady lang siya meaning to say uh, it's not moving but it's carrying the weight so gi maintain lang niya no so probably we can uh, have the example like sa kanang uh, sa heavy weight lifting diba dili man siya wala hay putong lifting nga mag, mag squats no so kung sa heavy weight is the the lifter holds the weight steadily no and holds it for a number of seconds or minutes you know so that's that's one uh, kind of isometric isometric contraction okay so dili siya mag move still lang siya while ga bear siya og weight now to give you an examples now I'll give you examples uh, of exercises which are concentrating on that area sa atong upper extremities so i give you there um, I, I just got it from the internet so um, this is applicable to men and women although in the picture kay babae na siya diha ha so dili ko feminist um, muna lang na kay crowded na o butangan na ko lahit na pud nga ano so this is applicable for men and women so we have there um, the tricep kickbacks no so the tricep kickbacks claro man sa picture kung magunsa ang forma and then the direction of your of your arm will be swinging to the back but then making sure that your elbow is in a steady position no? and then sa bicep curls oh diha ra pud ang kung asa na iyang position sa elbow diha ra pud na siya di na siya mag move ang move lang down kay kanang imong arm nga nag carry of weight and then the elbow just stay steady there and you might as well just want to take a look at the pictures there so there are nine examples and there are also recommended sets number of sets and how many seconds are you going to do for each set so you can actually get examples 
uh, all of the movements or all the exercises here when you come up already with your exercise plan. So, pwede ninyo siya pangahuyan dere o unsay parts sa inyong exercise routine.